Right, it's Tom's turn to do a video for once. Uh, what is the difference between a Corn V3 and Corn R2G, Corn ready to go? What we can see here is at the top, we can see a Corn V3. In the middle is a Corn ready to go white prototype, uh, or in fact, production sample from China. Uh, what we can see here is a uh, corn ready to go pre-production sample made by Mr. Elliot. What we can see on the R2G is an onboard microcontroller soldered directly to the PCB. We've got an Atmega 32U4 with the DFU bootloader. The other key difference is being the reset button on the bottom and a nice, uh, a nice low pro OLED display sitting on the USB-C port. Otherwise, all of the LEDs are the same. All of the case mounting points are the same as other corns. This is a corn V3. You can see I've taken the OLEDs off, but you can see we've got a separate controller board um, which is soldered into sockets. The ready to go needs absolutely no soldering. It is, as we say, made so that you can just plug it in and flash it. The firmware needs minimal changes from the default corn firmware. Um, we will be submitting a pull request to QMK uh, for, the, for those changes so that you can just download and get a ready made firmware for it. But yeah, ready to go, coming soon.